hello and welcome to all in this video we will learn about organization units in sap fi but before we start if you have not yet subscribed to our my support solutions channel then click on the subscribe button and also don't forget to click on the bell icon so that you will get the latest updates after every new video upload this is totally free share and like this video share the knowledge sharing is caring also you can go through my other videos on sap certification how to become sap consultant how to choose sap model and other relevant videos which are available now in this video what we will learn is define company define company code define credit control area define functional area define financial management area define business area assign company to company code assign credit control area to company code assign financial management area to company code yeah now at the start of our project we have to map our organization units and we have to configure our organization structure so before we start our actual configuration we must understand the organization units and structure of the client organization very well then only we can configure it into our system environment so it is a very important activity of the consultant now first step in our project implementation is define a company so now we we'll start our tutorial by defining a company so here i will put s p r o press enter click on sap reference img now click on enterprise structure click on definition financial accounting execute define company click on new entries here give your code for company maximum 6 digits are allowed give the name of company here we will give abc group company private limited then we have to put our street po box postal key city country language key and currency the last three options that we have to enter that country language key and currency for all these three last three entries there is a facility of find shortcut key to find is f4 you can press for help you can press f4 p, uh, key for possible entries now here we have to enter our country code and afterwards you, you can save the record okay so put your entry code language key and currency now save the record i already create this entry so system is showing the message as entry already exists with the same key okay i will take back uh, yeah we can find this entry to find a record click on the position button uh, 
and give your company code so this is our company code abc group company private limited okay so this is how we can define our company so this is the first step now we will create or we will define our company code so i will execute it click on this uh, execute button clock icon edit copy delete check company code click on execute and double click on edit company code data yes now here the company code it is mandatory to maintain your company code okay uh, this is a four key character either key or code okay and uh, company code has is uh, independent organizer unit uh, in it has uh, its own set of accounting books okay and this is uh, obliged to prepare financial statements under the state of law okay so company code is a legal entity that we can send now here i will click on new entries and we have to give company code four digits are allowed up to four digits okay abc group company private limited uh, we have defined company as abc group company private limited now here we are defining company code as abc company private limited okay so we can treat this as a subsidiary company of abc group okay now here uh, give your city give your country code currency and language key now save at the time of saving system will yeah give us the address screen please enter the your, your full address over here like uh, street house number and all the details now save the record now we will define our credit control area execute what is credit control area uh, credit control area the configurations regarding this credit control area are maintained by uh, sd and fi consultants okay so uh, some of the configurations to be made by sd and some of it, some are uh, to be made in A fi okay so uh, i will uh, click here on new entries here give the code for uh, credit control area put the currency now in fi variant column we will uh, here give k4 in our next video i will explain you about uh, variants okay now credit limit we have to maintain the credit limit for our customers individually now uh, if you select this check box or all company codes if i check this box then credit control area is applicable for all company codes okay this is the meaning of that tick now we will save the record I will take back credit control area for ABC company. I will put description and finally I will save the record. Now we will create functional area, we will define functional area, execute. Functional area, uh, we can use functional area to know our 
organization expenses for example if our management wants to know the expenses for production okay so this functional area concept is useful okay uh, if our company is following cost of sales concept then we need to define functional area okay now in this uh, screen i will click on new entries because uh, first of all as i told you we have to define organizational units and then we will assign our organizational units this is a first initial stage of our project then functional area will give code for our functional area and functional area for abc production we will save the record so we have create our functional area 2018 for our company called abc abc company private limited i will take back now i will take back now we will maintain our fm area so execute fm area is called as a financial management area financial management is useful in funds management and forecasting okay so we will click on new entries here we have to put maximum four digits are allowed five fifth digit is not allowed okay so 2018 will be our fm area fm area for abc or abc company fm area and give your currency and save the record okay take back now we will define our business area this is our business area define define our business area execute now business area is a independent organization unit okay uh, it is useful to prepare financial statements for the company for the company code okay uh, we can create a business area as per our business requirement for example if our company is involved in different product lines then we can create a business area product wise okay this is just for example okay uh, now we will uh, click on the new entries for creation of business area then give we will give a code for uh, business area 2018 we will give the same code uh, to avoid any type of confusion so business area for abc group will save the record now we'll take a back okay now we will assign our company code to company okay uh, so by the way uh, if our organization is uh, following consolidation business area approach then only we have to define our consolidation business area otherwise it is not mandatory hence we have not define our consolidation business area okay now we will directly assign i will close this and 
in assignment i will click on this tiny arrow financial accounting assign company code to company this is our first assignment assign company code to company so this is our company code 2018 and yeah click on the find the record okay so there are total 186 entries are there okay so we will assign company code to company in this step we have uh, create our company as a yeah, this is our company and we will assign now save the record so this is first step in assignment assign company code to company i will take back now second we will assign our credit control area to company code okay uh first thing that uh, assignment of business area to company code is not required because uh we can create a business areas across our company codes so uh if we define consultation business area then only we have to assign the business area to our consultation business area uh, but uh, we have not defined our consultation business area so uh, assignment of business area is not required okay now uh, we will assign our credit control area to company code yes now our company code is 2018 our credit control area is also 2018 so we will assign and save the record now assign the financial management area to company code assign yeah there is some there is some problem in my mouse so please bear with me yeah then assign company code to financial management area execute company code is 2018 business area uh, sorry fm area is 2018 so give your uh, code for fm area save the record take back now uh so we have done with our enterprise unit our enterprise structure and uh, in our next video uh, we will learn about variant okay fiscal year variant okay uh, so i request you to uh, share and like this video and uh, if you have any suggestions regarding this video see uh, this video is our uh, first video on uh, fi so if you have any suggestions or any queries regarding this video uh, please feel free to comment and uh, again don't forget to subscribe and uh, don't forget to share this video and keep in touch and bye bye